Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss, back again with another video. And today we're gonna take a look at the Lion Cooler Mini. Now this is the world's first battery and solar powered portable refrigerator and freezer. Now this is another one of those pre-production products. So let's take a look at the campaign video. The makers of the world's first battery powered portable solar fridge freezer brings you the new Lion Cooler Mini. The all-in-one mini refrigerator freezer is the ultimate van and truck companion. The Lion Cooler Mini neatly fits within the center console of your van, truck, or RV and features a lid that conveniently opens to both driver and passenger. Plus, the magnetic cover reveals a deep cup holder for even more on-the-road convenience. The Lion Cooler Mini keeps your food and beverages icy cold without ice. Iceless designs are the way of the future. Avoid condensation, soggy foods, and enjoy a delicious sandwich or salad and a cold drink at the park, beach, or anywhere you travel. The revolutionary multifunctional battery was designed so you can charge your laptop, camera, smartphone, or drone while the battery is inside your cooler. Remove the battery and now it transforms into a portable power bank. Stay on the move with 12 hours of consistent refrigeration. Easily recharge your cooler three ways. Directly into your vehicle's power socket, a home wall outlet, or directly into an Echo Power solar panel. Keep your cooler running 24 7 with a solar panel on a long drive or camping trip. The lightweight, compact, and wireless design makes the Lion Cooler Mini easy to transport. The integrated storage compartment makes a safe place to store your phone, keys, and wallet. Need an extra cooler for frozen food? The Lion Cooler Mini features a wide temperature setting, from cool to a freezing minus four degrees Fahrenheit. The cooler smart panel allows you to adjust the temperature directly on the display or from the app on your smartphone. The Lion Cooler Mini is the ultimate travel companion for your van, truck, or RV, designed to make your next road trip, camping, and tailgating experience so much better. All right, so you've seen a video for yourself. This is the definition of simple and effective tech. Now, let me say this. After using this for about two weeks, I love it, and I could never go back to using a regular cooler again. This is amazing. Now, let's talk about pricing. This one comes in two different versions. You got 18 liters and 28 liters. Now, you can buy it with or without the battery. Take my advice, buy the battery. You're going to love it, and I'll show you why in a minute. Now, if you want 18 liters without the battery, that's 245 bucks. Now, if you want 28 liters without the battery, that's 285 bucks. Now, if you want 18 liters with the battery, that's 425 bucks. And the one that you see right here, this is the best deal. 28 liters with the battery, 467 bucks. Now, when this hits the market, it's gonna be 658 bucks. So that's major savings. All right, so let's recap some of the features. Now there's three ways you can charge this cooler. Number one, battery powered. So that means you plug it in your house, let it charge up, unplug it, and take it outside. Now the battery is gonna last for about 10 hours. So this will be perfect for tailgating, perfect for the barbecues, perfect for the backyard parties. The next way is AC or DC powered. So you can plug this in into your house, in your man cave, and let it run forever. You can also plug it into your car. So if you're going cross country or you're gonna be in the car for a long time, you can plug this into your AC power and let it rock out all day, all night. Now the last way to charge this up is solar powered. Now you can buy the solar powered charger and you can leave this in your backyard forever. Okay, so three different ways to charge it up. Now two different volumes, 18 liter and 28 liter. This is the big boy right here, 28 liters. Now you can fit about 50 cans of soda in there. Now the portable power bank is rated at 193 watt hours. Now the temperature range on this cooler goes from 20 degrees Celsius to minus 20 Celsius. So that's 68 degrees Fahrenheit to negative four Fahrenheit. Basically freezing cold. All right, so let's take a look at the cooler. Now when you first get the cooler, 
It does come with your usual books and shit. Plug them and follow them. You got the plug for your house. You got the solar power plug. And the plug for the car. Now here's the front of the cooler. And on the bottom right, you got a compartment for your portable battery. We'll take a look at that in a minute. Now on this side, you got a storage compartment. You got a carry handle. You got a couple of vents. And you got your DC input and your solar power input. Now here's the back. If you look at the lower left corner, you can see the fan underneath the vent. Now on the other side, you just got a carry and handle. Now on the top, you do have a lid that opens up both ways, which I'll show you in a second. You got two cup holders that does come with a cover and you got your LCD display. Now here's a closer look at the control panel. You got your power button, your settings button, you got an LCD display, you got plus and minus that'll change different settings such as temperature, cooling modes, and battery mode. And underneath that, you have a USB slot for charging up other devices. All right, now check this out. This is a feature that I really like. The lid opens up both ways. So if you got this in the car and somebody's on the left, they can easily open it or if they're on the right. Now the top has these little ridges on it. That's gonna keep stuff from sliding around. Now let's take a closer look at the portable battery. You just open this slot, slide this right out. All right, so here's the battery. Now you got your power button, you got an LCD display, you got USB type C and two USB A's. You also got this bright flashlight. Now check this out, double tap, look at that. All right, so let's try this out. Let me grab a USB cable, let's grab a phone. And there it is, charging up. So you can charge three products at the same time. Now to put the battery back in, just open the slot. Gonna slide this in. And you'll feel it lock into place. You also got a little storage underneath there for keys or your wallet. Now let's check the USB on the top. You got the same cable. Plug this in. And there it is, charging up. Now I got this pack like if I was going to the beach. Take a look at how much you can put in the first storage compartment. So we're gonna open this up. Got my EDC knife. Got a Bluetooth speaker. Charging cable. Got some big headphones. We got two Galaxy phones. Some more cables and a set of earbuds. All of that in this storage compartment. Now, if you're wondering which size should you get, 18 liters or 28 liters, take a look at how much stuff I got in the 28 liter one, and I still got room for more. So we open this up. Of course, I got the Hennessy for when I hit the beach, and look at this. All right, so I got some cups. I got two two liters, which on a side note, I'm gonna talk about this in a minute, this is frozen. Got a four pack of Heineken's. We got a couple of waters. So when it's time to drive home, we got a canned soda, perfect for the top. We got a Tropicana, completely frozen. And another Tropicana, basically slushy. Now I could have put some sandwiches right on top of this. Now I wanna show y'all something crazy. All right, so last night I left this Heineken and this Coca-Cola on this table for eight hours. And I left the same thing in the lying cooler. So let's see the difference in the temperature. Okay, so with the Coca-Cola, we got 84 degrees. With the Heineken, 85 degrees. Now let's take the same products out of the cooler we got the Coca-Cola and we got a Heineken. Now let's try these out. Now, I'm gonna tell y'all a story about this Coca-Cola in a minute. <laughs> All right, look, look at this. Coca-Cola, 32 degrees. 
Heineken, 36 degrees. Now with the Heineken, you could see the frost. Now I'm up here with my air conditioner off. Look how much I'm sweating. Woo! <laughs> this is crazy. Now, quick story. Whenever I hear portable freezer, my main thing that, I, that I'm wondering is, is it really gonna freeze? Because anything could portably keep your stuff cold, but it, is it really gonna freeze? So I put this on the coldest temperature. I put the Coca-Cola in there, and a couple of hours later, it was frozen solid. This is frozen solid. Now, I recently turned it down so it could defrost a little bit. I can't even drink my Hennessy. It's that cold. On a scale of one to 10, okay? <laughs> on a scale of one to 10, I'm giving the Lion Cooler Mini a major, major, major go. Let's go ahead and wrap this up. All right, so the Lion Cooler Mini, for me, is a game changer. Now, usually when I go to the beach, or I go tailgating, or I go to the car meets, I buy a cooler from Walmart, I buy some ice packs, freeze them up overnight, or I go to the store and buy a whole bunch of ice and dump it in the cooler. Now that's cool, but at the end of the day, the ice is all melted, the food is all soggy, and your drinks are gonna be basically room temperature. With the Lion Cooler Mini, now all of my shit is gonna stay ice cold. So when I go to the beach and I make some margaritas, I can put the whole pitcher right in the cooler and keep it frozen. All of your food and beverage is gonna be the exact temperature that you want it all day long. This is a game changer for me. Anyway, Lion Cooler Mini, hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this one. Shout out to everybody rocking with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Boxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time, 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the new stream on Sundays. Y'all already know, stream drinks is on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys allowed. Oh yeah, special shout out to everybody following me on Snapchat. Flossy underscore Carter, that's where I'm at. And a special shout out to the notification squad. I see y'all in the comment section early. Hashtag salute. Oh yeah, one more thing. I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes and pitch and roll. It's your boy Floss and Mountain. Deuces. Spot one to beam up. some of that technology you gotta understand certain things subscribe to Flossy Carter he does reviews of all the latest technology the iPhones, the iPads, the Galaxies, the Samsungs, whatever the fuck the Beats by that doctor guy and he puts his kitty cat in the videos too for you something to look at you know I'm an animal lover so I like that shit so make sure you hit the subscribe button, the Flossy Carter on the YouTube, the follow button on the Insta face, and the like button on the face look. Because if you don't, we're going to have a fucking problem here. A bad one. Now hit the fucking subscribe button.